Hello and welcome to this Photoshop tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to be creating an aged colour photograph look. So we're thinking 1960s, maybe 1970s style. So you'll see from this image that the colours are starting to fade and there's, uh, you know, there's some real deterioration starting to take place. So our starting image is nice and fresh, nice and clean. So this is how you do it. We're going to create a, a new blank layer down the bottom right here and we're going to set the blend mode to multiply. Then click on the foreground colour swatch where I would like you to select a yellow colour. Click in OK. And then if you go to Edit and Fill, and fill with that foreground colour so we get the yellow uh, cast over the top. We're then going to click on our image layer here and click on a Curves Adjustment layer. Now with this Curves Adjustment layer, we're going to affect the, the channel separately. So we're going to work on red initially. And I'd like you to just move red up a little, so about, about so far. And then we're going to work the green. Green, we're going to move it up just a little tad more. And then we're going to work with blue. Now blue is going to be the strongest, so we're going to move blue up to about um, this height. So you need to play around with this to get the desired effect. And then I'm going to minimize that. And then we're going to create another curves adjustment layer. Uh, again, working with the channels, but this time we're going in the other direction. So red to the right a little. Then working on green. Green again, moving over just a little bit more. And finally working with blue. And blue will be the strongest. So really kind of bringing blue quite quite far across here. Lovely. You can adjust the uh, the levels. So clicking on levels here. And we're going to try and fade the black out a bit so the colors, are, you know, the, the uh, dark tones aren't quite as strong there. So fading that across. You can play with the mid-tone slider as well for effect. Uh, and then we're going to go into the background layer here, unlock it, place a blank layer underneath, and we're going to fill that, that blank layer with white. So edit, fill, and select white. Then back onto our image layer, and then control T to transform, holding shift to constrain the proportions, and holding alt to shrink from the center, will allow us just to bring it in just a little, just to create ourselves a border. There you go. Hey presto. So take a little bit of practice, play around with those colors until you achieve the desired effect. Thank you very much.